Hey y'all, it's Lulu. And I pray that you had a beautiful, wonder, wonderful, very explorative weekend. Okay. And now you are ready and prepared for the week ahead. Now we are in the third week of September. Where is the time going? I don't know. Moving forward. So let's go ahead and get started. What do you have for the earth signs? For the earth signs. What do you have for the air signs? What do you have for the fire signs? And what do you have for the water signs? So um, before I move any move another further, mm -hmm. um, I did hear earlier that um, with the elements going in this manner, some of you may uh, be able to um, see how they work with your passion, the fire, your work, earth signs, right? Water, emotion, and um, air, mental clarity. So let's move forward. Okay, I'm in a very state now. For the earth signs, you have calming. What I really feel with this before I read the back of this is that there may be a lot of um, movement for you this week. There may be a lot of coming, going, um, a lot of deals being made this week. And it's going to be important that you see things from a calm clarity overall. But we'll read the back of this to see what type of, what this... Um, um, how you will work with this energy this week. Um, I also really feel that it's going to be very important when it comes to matters of um, when it comes to uh, things that you are working on or working towards that you um, try not to overdo it is what they're saying. Um, you want to cross all your T's and dot all your I's when it comes to contracts or what have you. Now, this is Adhi, Ad, Adhi, 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 Adhi Mudra, why did I say, whatever, move forward, now, this assists with stillness, support, and balance, it benefits, uh, it, with, by helping you reduce your anxiety, it supports your muscular skeletal system, cultivates mental and physical restoration, and how you use this is that you open hands wide, Tuck thumbs in to the center of the palms. Curl the fingers loosely around the thumbs, making soft fist, fists with both hands. Wrist hands palm down on thighs. Lengthen the spine and breathe. This lowers your blood pressure, so you want to be very cautious when doing this. Your focus will be to um, rest in the calm of inner balance and support. So that kind of supports what the hell I was saying, don't it? Now, let's clarify. Clarify this calming for the earth signs, please. Clarify this calming for the earth signs. All right. So, yes, something about um, it may be signing of contracts or just making some type of commitment, trying to... Um, stick to those obligations that you have and, and follow the course with and um, not be led astray here yeah now there may be a reconciliation or a coming together of sorts there may be need to be a calming of um, emotions here when it comes to some type of commitment I also feel that you may even seek guidance when it comes to this because you do want, uh, you may be, there may be something when it comes to your relationships overall. So this may have a lot to do with your relationship, personal or otherwise. And the balance thereof, maybe with the Leo, Taurus, or what have you, Cancer. 
But what I'm getting here is that there may be um, a new addition to the home and that may be, or someone may be all of a sudden moving in. I feel like it may be a younger person or some family member. Overall, there will be some type of um, new addition to your home. You may be deciding to move in with someone, I, I'm unsure, but I feel as though there may, there's a need, there's a need to continue to remain focused and committed to keeping things together this week. There's a, t like, there, there, you may be celebrating or having, going to some type of celebration where this is going to bring you a lot of clarity when it comes to family. It'll bring you a lot of clarity when it comes to um, a, a, some particular, some relationship in particular in your life. But overall, I feel as though you will have a boost in your confidence by the end of the week. There will be a boost in self-esteem. Um, there will be a lot, like, there may even be a new baby coming in. Someone may be getting news of a new child, a child being born, or someone is pregnant. But there's some, there's a huge need, I feel, for you to really relax in the moment this week. There's a need for you to um, really, you know, hang loose and let, let your hair down this week. You may want to delegate some of the responsibility here this week when it comes to what it is that you, the things that you have to accomplish or need to accomplish. You may need some help and they want you to ask for it here. This may even be a proposal. Someone may be proposing here. An apology or a love offer coming in. Or maybe this is you doing it, Earth sign. Yeah, I'm saying that what needs to be revealed will be revealed to you. I also feel as though it's important this week for you to go into your sacred space as often as you possibly can in order for you to really, um, this is a new emotional experience, I feel, or a new level to the to some relationship that you have, whether it's with yourself or others, right, or someone else. But overall, it's all connected to me. There's some answers that you need that are coming this week, Earth sign. And they want you to not force or try and shift um, things here. Just keep going with the flow. This isn't a good week for you to um, start anything new that you haven't already planned. Because I don't know why I get like retrograde, Mercury retrograde energy with this too. Like this may not be a good time for you to try and start some new um, venture. But really go over the paperwork or go over the details here. Something is finally coming full circle when it comes to a relationship or something that you're committed to. Some of you may be deciding to go back to school. You have someone encouraging you. You may even be meeting new people this week, which will give you some type of um, inner calm. It's like you will finally meet someone who um, meshes well with your energy here. There's a lot of joy. So this is beautiful for the earth signs. I also feel that someone may be revealing that they have a crush on you. You already had, uh, you already kind of knew that. But you're trying to figure out how you can make time for this person. Or some of you may even be delegating between how to make give someone or something more time and attention because you have your plate full, so you're unsure. But the, it will be, it will be revealed to you this week. So there is, there are answers um, coming. There, are, there is um, some type of resolution to some situation. Mm -hmm. Everything that you've been working on and working towards, there it is. Something that you thought was unattainable, it's being illuminated, and you will finally see that all the work that you've put in, the dedication, the hard work, the dedication, you honoring the the call of your soul. It's paying off by the end of the week. I feel as though some of you may be pushed further, um, like you may be getting a promotion. Or it may be a surprise promotion. But overall, there's some beautiful energy here as long as you remain calm. Keep your arms and your legs and the vehicle. Thank you. So that's what I get for you here. I also feel as though if you've been um, overworking... Are you needing to heal from a situation? Some There's a lot of healing energy here. So if in the past week you've been feeling down or feeling like, you know, things weren't really turning around for you, they're turning around this week. There are some things that are being uncovered. Like I really feel like there's some strong feelings or some type of strong emotion coming out that you, you had no idea of whether this is coming out of you to someone or someone is doing this to you. But it's coming through. And there will be some type of balance. This may even be soulmate energy here is what I feel. But I'm also getting here that there may be someone that uh, finds out that 
Okay, someone may, shit, here we go. Someone may find out about another person or situation and become jealous, but it feels like you are going to go with who it is that you want to be with and leave this other person behind and it'll be fine. Some of you may even um, be somewhere and, and with someone on a date or out with someone and see someone that you used to deal with or have dealt with while you are out. But it's okay because it just gives you even more courage that you made the right decision or confirmation that you made the right decision. So that is the earth sign. All right. Air. Air, this is all about grounding. So let's see here. Um, with you being an air sign and, of course, with this um, with us moving into Libra season and whatever else is going on in the cosmos, before I read the back of this card... What I'm getting is that um, you may have, you know, been all up, all up in the clouds about certain things or certain ways of doing things. And this week is going to be a very important, you know, for you to ground. I know I'm already starting this week off with really having to get all of the way, like, the knee deep in the earth. Now, this may be involving fa uh, family really needing to do some root work. Um, some of you may be doing a lot of digging into your lineage to find out certain, um, you know, find, you may be finding this out on the astral plane, but you will be digging deeper. They're saying you will be digging deeper into, um, your ancestry. Some things are going to be revealed to you here when you really sit down and, and get to the root of a situation. Um, I also feel something tickled my side so I'm like this is going to be beautiful okay um there is a lot of um warm comforting feelings when it comes to family this week some of you may be stressing or worrying about family this week or um not being able to really um control your thoughts there may be some anxiety or worry regarding a family situation even though things have been going good it feels like for you there may be some challenges that um, you've been facing that need to come full circle, and they will. Um, I also feel these are the cards I got, right? I also feel I'm not even trying to get cards. I'm just doing this so that I can keep the energy flowing in my eye. Yep, there is a clarity. There's clarity coming after this, um, after things come full circle, whatever it is that you are worrying about. I really feel like um, that grounding even comes in with um, that anxiety. You know, this is Star Player September. So it's going to be very important that you um, try and remain as level headed as possible, air sign, okay? Um, you don't want to act on emotion. Some of you may be so filled and um, overjoyed with certain types of emotion that it really, you may not understand why you are feeling some type of way or feeling this could be outside of you as well it could have to do with some heartache or um some separation or grief surrounding what you find regarding your family but you're going to have an aha moment there's going to be this new beautiful creative energy flowing through for you to um take off into a new direction here some of you may even be getting an offer to travel or you go on vacation this week and find out some things here. Yeah, because you may have been feeling restricted, but you will be triumphant at the end of the day. Whatever this is, this creative spark or this new passion or this new passionate offer or what have you, maybe it's smoking weed. I feel that it has much to do with um, some conflicted, conflicting energy that you've had here in the recent past. Where you feel as though you didn't know how you were uh, you were being pushed, pulled and tugged in all types of different directions. But they're saying that you are supported in whatever it is that you um, choose to do. Once you really get this inspiration to continue to move forward, you will be um, birthing some new ideas, giving birth to new ideas. Uh, some of you may um, actually finally get pregnant. You may have been working on getting pregnant. Or somebody water may be breaking here, right? Or there could be some good sex. Don't get me started. Trying to remain calm. That's why I'm on these earth signs. It's time for us to ground, right? Um, I'm also seeing here where there's a lot of support spiritually for whatever this is that this new beginning that you have when it comes to um, what you want to create and how you want to go about doing this. I also feel 
that some of you may be wrapped up in you may be okay wrapped up in a situation that you are unsure about or need some more clarity on and it may be confusing to you because you've had all of these different opinions um, and you feel mentally confined because there may be different people saying different things or different people with their input and you don't know which way to go even though you've this self-love is coming in real strong um, a lot of things are going your way, but then even at the same time with things going your way, there may be some type of financial setback here this week as well that you want to pay attention to. So that's where the grounding comes in. So with the grounding, it says this assists you with a stability, connection to the physical body, grounding. Um, the benefits of this is that it reduces stress and blood pressure. It activates the root chakra. Um, of course, with this, what you would do is extend the index and middle fingers downward to make inverted V-shaped peace signs with both hands curl the pinky and ring fingers inward toward the palms and place thumbs on fingertips lightly extend arms and bring the tips of the middle and index fingers into the ground or tops of the thighs relax shoulders lengthen spine focus you will focus on being grounded to the earth and say that you receive support and abundance okay now i also want to say with this for the women you can do um, this hand gesture over um, um, place them by your belly button and um, extend them out toward like that <laughs> whatever and massage your um, ovaries and this also helps with um, the release of certain blocked energies but it also helps to um, it helps to release blocked energy as well as um, it um, there's some estrogen that will be released as well for some of you girls. And it also helps with the sex drive and a number of other benefits that it has as well. So I thought I'd throw that in there. All right. Fire. Determination. All right. What I'm getting with this card is that um, they want you to continue to um, persevere move forward on what it is that you are wanting to do and how you want to have some things how you want to accomplish certain things here you're going to have to continue yeah it may have to do with love overall it's something that you really put your this is you following your heart's true desires um if you are determined to get it you you can have it but they want you to make sure that you are very straightforward and honest with yourself and others as well it feels as though um even if you come to the space where you feel as, you know, there's an aha moment and he got the aha moment or the this great insight here ruling with an iron fist in his um, hand. So things are coming full circle on um, something that you really have been mentally exhausted about. You've really put a lot of time, effort and energy into. This could easily be a court case or um, something to do with having to... Um, Take your time moving forward because you're trying, you're working on manifesting something as well as putting in the work. And it's going to pay off right when you feel like giving up here. It may have something to do with you having um, your hands in a number of pots trying to, or um, spinning a, um, a number of plates, trying to spin a number of plates at one time and eating some help, but you are determined to continue and move forward. It could, yeah, um, it could also be that there may be a Capricorn or um, water sign or whoever. Someone may be coming towards you wanting to make things right with you. And they may um, have a, a nice sense of humor and they may even try and sweep you off your feet. And it'll be right when this person, this may be who is determined if it's not you. Um, not wanting you to give up on a certain situation. They may be um, attached to you in a way where they may be obsessed here. That's the other way I see this. When someone wants to make a commitment and wants to birth a new situation with you, there may be a new beginning or a new um, uh, some home improvements as well. And you're taking your time with those. The other way that I see this here is that you want to move forward. You may be wanting to move forward with someone, but really uh, feeling as though there may be some manipulation or um, some toxic energy surrounding it, and you want to take your time with this here, fire sign. So that's totally up to you. But I do feel that when it comes to your stability and security, they want you to continue to work towards that. Make sure that you take the time out to um, really assess, right? Because you got two fours, right? So they want you to take the time out to really assess what um, is stability. What is it? What does that look like? What does that feel like? Are you really in that space moving forward? 
um, there's a lot of clarity that will be coming through meditation for you by the end of the week. I also feel that um, as some of you may, I don't know, I just heard bod uh, body dysmorphia. Hmm. So someone may be um, diagnosed with that this week. But it feels like they're not going to hold on to that. They don't feel like that's what that what they're what they are going through. So that's probably for one person now. And whatever it is that you you are working on or working working towards here, they want you to keep that passion, right? Um, be sure to remember um, how much you love what it is that you are working what it is that you want be sure that you you are taking your time in a certain situation so that you won't come to this space of feeling as though you put in more work than you should or have um you know they yeah put in more work than you should put in you know continue to move forward but also be sure that you are not overdoing it is what they're saying here because things are coming full circle for you I had to take the time, pull it back. It feels like um, there may be a connection between you and someone here. Someone may be offering, wanting to, um, you may be trying to make an offer that to move away from someone or move out, and they don't want you to leave, so now you have to figure out a different way of doing it. Whether it's a relationship or living with someone, this is strong twin flame energy for me right here. Right, and then this we got them looking like the lovers, right? So, there's something with a union between you and another person that may be toxic or feel toxic, but it's I really feel whatever this connection is between you and this person, there's a misunderstanding, miscommunication a lot of miscommunication. One person is more committed to the situation than the other one, and you, and it may be you who is determined to try and make this work, but they want you to take step back and take your time here. Because you may have a lot of feelings for this person. They want you to reassess what is the connection between you and this person. How does this work? What does the future look like to you? And how can you fix the communication issues amongst the two of you? So, we have determination. This assists with spiritual discipline, transformation, and willpower. The benefits is that it optimizes digestion and assimilation of nutrients. It supports the kidneys and adrenal glands, cultivates determination and commitment to releasing self-limiting benefits beliefs <laughs> self-limiting self beliefs with each hand curl the fingers inward bringing the pads of the fingers toward the palms thumbs on the outside bring the heels of the hands together and join the second joints of the fingers extend the two thumbs and bring together hold hands lightly against your abdomen Relax the shoulders down and lengthen the spine. This helps you to, um, this is the focus that you should use. I'm sorry. The focus, this should focus on you being in the affirmation, using the affirmation of my sense of positive determination arises from within. My sense of positive determination arises from within. My sense of positive determination arises from within. I like it. Also, um, this can be, if you can get someone to use this when they massage you, if you can find someone who really likes you, not somebody that just want to be massaging you so they can get some. No, we're not talking about them. But someone who is really um, liking, like, likes to give massages, I think that this will really help for the um, shoulder blades for you as well to release a lot of tension for you. If they could use this um, hand posture to massage you, that would really um, be beneficial. Now, water signs, it says breathe. Um, this week, I feel like it will be very important for you to, um, even um, in the midst of chaos or whatever is going on in your life, it's going to be very important for you to take time out, take a step back, and really breathe. This may be a week of meditation for you, so try not to rush anything or force anything or try and make things happen. The things that you are clinging to, try and see if you can release those as you go. Um, as you move forward, um, all of, okay, so 
some of you may want to get out buy some water or this may be a good week for if you haven't taken a spiritual bath recently it's going to be important for you to take one this week at least um, for those of you really needing to clear out your energy you want to take do a three-day bath some of you may need to do a seven depending on where you've been but I heard three do your three-day bath make sure that you are um, putting your all of your intent into your the spiritual um, vacay so to speak a spiritual retreat because what I'm getting is you may have been very tense you may have been um, around people who may have been highly opinionated and you want to just take a step back this week okay because I really feel like there's a lot of clarity when you don't even say anything this is a week of listening and not speaking too much letting people vent allow them to vent because you're going to learn a whole lot um, when you do do your breathing um, throughout the week um, at your desk or what have you when you do your breathing be sure to um, focus on inhaling beautiful energy whatever that is to you whatever it is that you are trying to transmute these could be negative thoughts that are coming in these could be um, rushing thoughts but you want to breathe in for instance you want to breathe in I am resilient and breathe out I'm a pushover breathe in um, Breathe in, today's going to be a good day, and breathe out, these hoes got me fucked up, right? You're releasing what you don't want and pulling in what you do. So I done pulled a lot of cards. Let's see what they're saying. So some of you may receive some type of message about someone wanting to, uh, some idea, um, a business proposal or some idea that someone has that they, that, um, they want to see if you're ready to take it to the next level or to the next step here. But this could also be someone that is really passionate about you, um, sharing some information with you here and it may be your boss it may be someone that you have some type of connection with where um, they need for you to take control of a certain situation between the two of you or this is what you are doing this is also an Aries right I feel as though um, some of you may be having some this these new ideas this new way you may have had an epiphany recently so they want you to take your time with this um, energy that is coming in because it's going to bring you financial reward um, once you make up your mind on what it is that you need to do this is really about you taking control of who you are how you want to move forward and really um, working on your investments working on what your next move will be when it comes to uh, family here when it comes to finances when it comes to your stability and security now there may be a marriage or a divorce here that um, there's some type of contract being signed and I feel um, honestly that whatever happens here with this agreement with this um, judgment with this um, new beginning some of you may even be deciding to move or move in with someone you may be meeting someone um, after when you decide to take back control of your life this week and really just calm down right calm be calm here mm. um, there's going to be some type of issue with uh, there may be some fighting over um, finances there may be some type of disagreement or conflict regarding something with family I got two fives so there may be some type of conflict when it comes to the balance of uh, the home um, right when you were thinking that like there's gonna be some arguments some disagreements or what have you but they want you to breathe right so if you're being pulled in different directions or um, opposing um, something to do with opposing um, op uh, people opposing your ideas or wanting things to go this way or the other you may be in a group environment or a team environment and you are trying to focus on the practical stuff and other people are it's all ego coming in they want you to pull back there may even be some type of disagreement or argument here that has to do with a commitment or someone committing to school and not really wanting to or wanting any advice I also feel here that this is the other five I got they just want you to breathe and walk away from these disagreements because it just feels like this has something to do with money or family and um, it's probably both right so there's going to be some conflict regarding uh, I even feel as though there's some type of judgment or decision made regarding um, possibly a DWI DUI case um, something is coming full circle with um, karmic reward 
someone is getting their just due, they, you know, this may be something that happened in the past that finally you are being redeemed, uh, being falsely accused here. And as long as you commit to your path, things are going to work out. They're saying whatever workout means to you, it could mean anything really. Someone may be apologizing or letting you know. You may not even want it, though. You may be in a space of just pulling back from people because it just feels like there may be so many different directions that you are pulled in. Uh, it feels like there may be so many things that are requiring your time, effort, or attention. But overall, I really feel that people will be asking for money this week. Or there may be fighting over money. I feel like you will be getting some type of counseling or asking for help seeking higher knowledge or seeking a way out of a situation that you feel that it's been hard for you to get out of this week so they want you to breathe it's coming to you you know right when you are feeling stagnant or complacent there it is right the answer that you need to get out of this situation clarified as five of wands for the water signs yeah you may have um you may have already been indecisive on which way to go or how to go. Like you may be um, juggling uh, between two job offers or um, two business ventures or two people. But overall, I feel like w once you get clarity, your focus, what it is that you want to focus on, will be illuminated to the point where you know for a fact that you made the right decision because you put in so much hard work. I also feel that you'll be taking some time out um, to really get out of nature and enjoy yourself here because it's some toxic energy in here. They just want you to breathe through it. I feel like it's outside of you. I don't feel like you can, uh, you can if, it, if it begins to affect you, then of course it, it's not outside of you anymore. So you want to pull yourself back and that's where that breathing comes in. Any threats to your home or any threats to your finances or what have you, they just want you to pull back and detach. Take your time. Try not to overindulge. Try not to overextend your energy or overextend help as well because I'm seeing here that there's a beautiful... Um, energy surrounding the kids being protected, the home being protected. There's a beautiful energy surrounding um, you making the right decision as long as you don't allow people to piss you off this week. Don't let nobody piss you off this week, okay? Be mindful. That's the main thing. So this week, y'all breathing, okay? Focusing on your breath. Now, this is the Brahma, Brahmara, Brahmara Mudra. Hmm? This helps ease, it um, helps with boundaries, and it helps with immunity. The benefits of this uh, mudra is it relieves allergies and nasal congestion, which has a lot to do with the third eye. So you're really going to want to breathe this week, okay? It assists with um, the immune system. Um, it opens and redirects breath to the head and sinuses. There it is. The instructions for this is bring the tip of the index fingers to touch the base of the thumbs. Touch the tip of the thumb to the top of the middle finger. Allow all other fingers to extend outward. Rest the backs of the hands on the tops of the thighs, palms facing up, right? Now, you will focus, your focus will be, I sense and open to perfect balance and breath. I sense and open to perfect balance and breath. I sense and open to perfect balance and breath. Hmm, I like it. All right, so that is y'all's reading. I pray that it resonates with somebody. It's not going to resonate with everybody. We know that now, don't we? Thank you. Thank you all for your patience and... I'll see y'all soon. Mm. Bye.